Ring, ring, the 90s are calling. 90! It instantly smells like sugar. Sugar ash! Ah! And now let's dunkaroo. Hey, welcome back to my channel. I'm Dana with your weekly Dash of Degs. And today I'm back with my segment, A Taste and a Dash, where I try things that you guys are curious about, things that I wanna try to see if they're worthy of your taste buds because ain't nobody got time for bad food. And as you guys saw, today the 90s are back, baby. Yes, the reason I'm living my 90s baby dreams is because Dunkaroos have made a comeback. What? I'm getting all the feels, you guys. 90s. 90s, we're back. Yeah. I'm showing the age now, but I tried to be cool, like a 90s pop star. And we're back, baby. So before we get started, I want you guys to dash along to that subscribe button. And subscribe, of course, because if you don't like this video, you'll like the next one. And make sure to tick that notification bell so we can all be here together. Watch when the next one comes out. And of course, so you can join the dash Bam! So let's get started. Table comes up. I was at Walmart yesterday. They had limited edition Dunkaroo cookies. What? If you guys don't remember what Dunkaroos are or if you're too young to know, they were like this. They're cookies that you dunk in vanilla frosting, like cake frosting that has sprinkles. I mean, genius right they also started selling these a little history of dunkaroos they stopped selling them in 2012 i believe so it's been eight years since they've been back on the market they discontinued dunkaroos because it was one of those things where they're starting to sell sugary unhealthy foods in a fun way because dunkin dunkaroo so it was making these unhealthy foods very enticing for a kid so general mills stopped selling them which is funny because now betty crocker is selling them let's dive into nostalgia here's what the package looks like Got our Dunkaroos cookies, sugar cookie dough, and vanilla frosting with rainbow sprinkles. The back it says, a blast from the past. I mean, I could have been a 90s pop star. Mm. Here's the instructions. It says it makes either six big cookies or 24 mini cookies. Do we make 24 or six? While your Dunkaroo cookies bake, take a trip back to a time when grunge ruled the rock scene Everyone had a pager on their hip. Baggy jeans and track suits were the height of fashion. And jelly shoes were totally a thing. Can we bring jelly shoes back? They were so fun. Let's open this bad boy up. Alrighty, I was kind of moving it around though. Presentation isn't 100. Whoa, there's two frosting pouches. I am so excited, you guys. Should I make six or 24? Let's do 24. All right, I might do six because I had it out for a while, so the dough has kind of gotten a little soft. Like I said, I would just do six, but I'm doing 24. So comment down below if you're 90s baby or a wannabe 90s baby. What is something that you miss the most? from the 90s that you wish they would bring back. Ay ay ay. Don't let your dough sit out for a long time because it gets really mushy. Dana, you knew that, come on. I think for me from the 90s, what I missed the most, I was a kid, so the lack of responsibility. I mean, I'm an adult now, so you know, hashtag adulting is hard. So I liked the innocence of it all, you know? You just kind of didn't really have to worry about anything. Don't get me wrong, I enjoy my life now. I enjoy being an adult, you know, sometimes. It would be nice to not have any responsibilities. Of course, make sure your hands are clean, otherwise that's nasty. All right, we'll try to make them as close to the originals as possible. I wish they would have just made them small already. I mean, come on. I guess this way you feel like you made it yourself. Gotta go wash my hands and stick it in the oven. So now that those are baking, let's try the OGs. I mean, they're not the OGs, but you know, the ones that are already made. I don't exactly remember what Dunkaroos taste like because it's been a long time, but I'm sure they'll be delicious. Oh man, it instantly smells like sugar. All right, we got our D for Dunkaroo, but really for Dana. I mean, they already knew. Dana Roos. Dana Roos, ah! Okay, <laughs> so this is what it looks like. It looks like a little token, a little coin. That's how thick it is. And now let's... Dunkaroo. All right, we got the perfect bite. We've got our frosting. We got our little sprinkle down there. I'm so excited. Mm. I mean, you really can't go wrong with that. The perfect like shortbread sugar cookie with cake frosting and sprinkles. This tastes like it's absolutely terrible for me. I'm Dunkarooing. Mm. 
I mean, this is just perfect. 10 out of 10. I know it's probably not very good for me, but I mean, it's like a child size portion. It's like an Oreo, but better. Because sometimes the Oreo filling can be kind of stiff, which is good on its own, right? But this, it's just cake icing. So it's creamy, it's smooth. It has that, like, that taste that, like, it just came out of that plastic tub and you're about to slather it on that homemade boxed cake that you made. I'm not gonna eat them all. No, I want to. Because I have to wait for the ones in the oven. But now it's just sweet torture because I have to wait for these to cool. But luckily it just said to wait two minutes. While we wait, it said to put our frosting in a bowl for dunking. And it said to just knead it like topping. Do not microwave. That's about it. We've got our Dunkin' frosting. Yeah! Let's take one of these. Oh, it's already kind of crispy. We've got our cookie. We've got our frosting. Let's get to Dunkin'. Uh-oh, a little too soft to dunk. I've got my frosting. I've got my sprinkles. Guys, mm-mm-mm, that's good. We've got our D-Dunkaroo, Danaroo cookie. Our sugar cookie, not too much bigger. Okay, no, it's like twice the size. I'm gonna dunk this one in here. It's designated frosting. I'm pretty sure these are the exact same frosting. I see. Mm. Hmm. This one, the one that came with the bakeable cookies, is actually just a tad bit sweeter. Mmm. 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 It's so good with the baked cookies because they're still kind of soft in the center, but they're crunchy on the outside. So it's such a nostalgic taste, not even just like 90s, but like like baked store-bought cookie dough. I haven't had it in a long time, and that's what this tastes like. Like It's so nostalgic and so good paired with the cake frosting. It's like hitting all the feels right now. I'm in my happy place. Let's have one more. Let's get Dunkin'. does not disappoint mm. i know in no way this is good for you but you know what i take that back it's good for the soul because <laughs> i'm so happy right now i'm like vibing my 90s i gotta take a pic of this guys zetus lapidus i hope you guys get that reference my review is 10 out of 10 it's so yummy so nostalgic so sugary but i feel like it's also like not too sweet you know like to the point where you're like oh you know it's like the perfect amount of sweet perfect amount of nostalgia 90s are back baby at least for right now but i loved this blast of the past let me know what you guys think guys these were a slam dunk see what i did there slam dunk a roos ah, but yeah, no, seriously, these were really good. I enjoyed them. I am trying to convince myself not to eat another one, but you know what? Why not? It's for you guys. So cheers. Mm. I love that they're still chewy on the inside and crunchy on the outside. It's like an upgraded version of these. Yeah, two thumbs up. I am very thirsty right now though. So let's wrap this up so I can get some water. It's a lot of sugar but it's so good. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments down below what 90s products you want them to bring back and what you guys want me to try slash review last time. <laughs> Sugar ash! Ah! Let me know what you guys want me to try slash review slash make next time. Uh, your girl Dana loves to eat, in case you guys haven't noticed already. Probably one of my favorite activities. So, where was I? Okay, subscribe to my channel. Because if you don't like this video, you'll like the next one. I'll be back to the 2020s. And make sure to tick that notification bell so we can all be here together. And you can be a part of the Dash family when the next video comes out. Alright guys, see you next week. Bye! So if you guys do want to try these, it did say that this blast of a... It did say that this blast from the past is limited edition. So I don't know how long they're going to have these on the shelves. But definitely go look for it. I went to Target first. They didn't have them. I went to Publix. They didn't have them but walmart always trusty walmart had them so if you do want to try them go into the cookie dough section that's where i got these and the single serving nostalgia pack was right by the registers i couldn't find it in any of the aisles but it's right by the registers try it comment down below what you guys thought as always i love you all see you next week bye